guys i hope you got fresh you welcome to fxb universe channel so guys you've been asking me like how do i swing trade or uh, all my trades and taking the perfect entries so via this video i will show you how i swing trade and how i manage to capitalize the world trends some of the trades and bazo one actual like the previous days pairs and bazo nimekwani is swing one of them in the us 30 out chf which is the actual trade ambo pia i provided you the setups up up on youtube make sure you watch it about this video i give it out the actual setup and nileza ku maximize estimated pips me i'm seeing uh, estimated pips me i'm seeing which would actual a uh, swing trade the other one is ni new zealand usd and the other one was usd card which was a actual sell swing trade and the other one was gbp jpy all these are actual swing trades but i don't even swing only swing trade now woman i think in a nezanika swing trade at the same time nezanika nika day trade within a swing trade so we call this step was hedging in or scaling in some of lic members najum takwa if you want now among the our community you know how we trade the scaling in and scaling out these are actually strategies and also most of the time we use them now within this video i'll give you the actual tips and also to me when we keep on a swing trade will it be worth worth of it guys don't ignore this video because at the end of the video i will even show you how some of the one of the swing trade and nearly nearly like how i did it and how you can also do it on the previous conditions market environments do change every time but they repeat themselves every time whenever you see something on the charts now you can even maximize or use the previous tips and basel possibly do zilifanyika kwenye certain trade now with this video i will show you how i do it so let's jump into it Make sure come out you are new to this channel you like and subscribe and you can also uh share to your friends even like or recommend any topics that unataka uyone kwa hii channel and i will talk about it in the comments now um before kuendelea zaidi i want to show you this now in the well, like what is swing trade how what are actual trading styles that we have kuna day trading kuna scalping trading we also have position trading is not in some of the uh, trading style that we have okay apa si just si mention only strategies but swing trading swing trading the actual trading style that we talk about now swing trading is only una kuona una take positions ila una hold that position for a couple of of weeks days even months but this is it me as a and above always uh, five months and below that's all we call about the swing trade now swing trading you just hold a trade for a couple of days or even weeks okay now for swing traders kitu ambacho wanakifanya they want to capitalize the world trend maybe come on the uptrend uh the the uptrend now you capital the world trend now from the up you buy until the end of the trend okay so also swing trade is normally held anywhere from seven days like i said uh peer swing trades usually are kept are kept open for a few days as long as the swing or the actual trend is in a, a, a is in its own trend okay so most one I, I don't even recommend to come back only come again but only strategy I'm gonna go on to me I come in a in a quarrel we could hold it ready for a couple of days and then you can even uh what the just a swing trade now the actual advantage is that could swing trade one of them you come back okay on a day on a swing trade in a coupe in a coupe in a mood I could focus on the other trades on your daily activities just a simple lifestyle for example mimi na simple lifestyle ambapo naweza nikakutana na watu au naweza nikafanya to me personal mambo yangu while my trades is in a run okay that's the only advantage that when you are swing trading outside from scalping outside from day trading okay 
So the other advantage kwenye swing trading inakupa room ya ku de attach emotions zako kwenye certain certain tra, certain trade ambayo umetek. So remember like trading ni all about emotions now. If you are you are, you are trading then your emotions are to that trades which means you are almost driven to to cause such a trades where they are, in, they, are they are still going to rise into profits. So ukiona swing trade you are our you are far away to deactive they attach your emotions from such trades now you let them learn into profit like any peer the other the other advantage kwenye swing trade inakuwa allow we kufanya kitu na kita scaling in scaling in kwamba uko na origin trades lakini kwenye origin trades you can even day trade on the origin trade ambayo uko na which means you swing okay so these are, are only two advantages unapokuwa na swing trade but now i need to give you like Uh, actual tips ambazo unaweza kutumia ukiapo na swing trade now i just highlighted this one here there are, are, are the tips guys is up on the tips ambazo unaweza kutumia when day trading and not when day trading i'm sorry this is a swing trade okay so swing, swing trading tips the first tip is always identify the trending pairs and hapa nimejaribu kukuwekea actual trending pairs ambazo they are always in a trend when i say trending pairs i mean the actual pairs ambazo you can identify the swing low swing guys swing low swing guys swing low swing guys all the way up now such pairs one of them the out pairs most of time to identify like out pairs was now nature swings swings i mean like uh, you only see the the actual trend but Remember the market is not always straightforward and it's not in a straight line. Tuna actual move about tunaita ni impulse and correction, impulse correction, impulse all the way up. Now for how the pairs is very simple for them to identify such trends especially for beginners now, okay? I hope you umenielewa uh, kwa kwa hii first step and the other pairs are euro, euro pairs. Maybe euro USD, euro JPY or um, or euro nzd all these are actual trending pairs okay so the second tip is always analyze analyze and enter on the origin trend remember like unapoko unataka kuingia kwenye na certain pair just for the purpose of swing trading we always enter on the origin trend i mean when the this actual trend is starting now you ignore like all these refreshments they don't find you Uh, let's say kama market ipo around let's say let me take an example the actual law is here you see this is actual law around here now if this is the actual law around here i don't enter around here i actually enter on the origin origin trade where the actual trend started that's when i enter a trade now for the reason beyond is that And for example ni kiingia around here kwenye hii area around there hii entry ama hii correction it ni kiingia kwa kwa around this origin around this area stop loss inabidi iwe kubwa so which means kama nitapata hii retracement nitakuwa kwenye drawdown now for you kiingia kwa origin trade easy drawdown i mean easy retracement zinakuwa azikudhuru they don't even affect you such a draw uh, such a pullback okay So that's a only that's a second tip like ukiapo na taka swing trade make sure you enter when the trend is starting okay but the other tip is choose your entry style now remember unapokuwa unataka kuingia kwenye um any any kind of entries especially for swing trading make sure you enter you choose your your entry styles and entry style zipo za aina mbili unaweza kufanya kwenye Uh, maybe you want to enter on the exact uh, uh, point your point of interest like now when this move is happening you enter well seeing the, that such such chart wa wengi kwenye maybe kwa kutumia buy limit ama uh, stop limit or, or or pending position okay so you have to choose your actual penny the other tip wa uh, kwenye kuchagua your trading your entry styles Unaweza kuwa umelipia maybe premium for trading view for you to they can even send you uh, what uh, they can even send you some uh, some wallet kwa, kwa application so that you don't miss any setup okay 
and the fourth uh, tip is always uh, manage your trades when in profits and the break even you are uh, you are your profits for example come on you make your trade now and to swing simple when you swing trade and nataka ni fanya maybe um like how do i monitor such a trade until my take a profit hits i remember last video nearly explained like how i manage my actual trades make sure if i if i know watch it this video nenda uyangalie ni video ambayo nilielekeza like vile ambavyo nakuwa na manage my trades uh kutokea from my entry point until it targets okay i explained it very well make sure e video ita pop up uh, kwenye right corner go watch it before we continue okay and the tip number five is always focus on the price action money get price action the own language of the market guys if you cannot lead the price action you cannot even predict the future price movement you need to understand exactly how price action acts on the chart it's when you can identify like how trends how actual pair amba unataka o swing trade it end ambaka maybe level friend if you cannot lead such a price you cannot even position trade or swing trade even day trading okay so make sure you focus on the price action price action has been covered when our elite course and boy po exclusive when our our f my our fxb university website make sure you check it out and the tip number six is use the proper risk management reason beyond kwa ni tunatumia proper risk management tunapokuwa una swing trade ni kwa sababu swing trading is all about the attaching your emotions to such trades to let them learn kwa kiepo hauna proper risk management means you are likely to close such a position before even they hit your target profit okay so hakikisha the moment to jaingia trade umetumia proper risk management according to your capital i remember i even explained this properly like how you risk it and actual the, the actual tips that we look at when before even entering a trade okay so make sure you check out uh, about such such videos and boss and we'll keza kusiana risk management okay so after seeing easy tips yamba so tunazitumia kwenye uh, uh, risk management or even kwenye swing trading now let's see uh kwenye now how to use them on the live chat guys okay i want to show you exactly like uh, i know you tali uko najua uh, unajua how to properly uh analyze from top down analysis okay so i'll just assume kwamba unajua how to do a proper uh proper top down analysis now from here tupo kwa one day amboy ni new zealand usd and unaweza kaona tulikuwa na he a strong strong push the all the way down like tulikuwa na hi down trend you can see now here he ilikuwa downtrend kwenye hata time frame and he actual downtrend he kawa breakdown unaweza kaona tuli break he uh, our dow tukatengeza a new row and to cutting is a new high around there now for right now we are looking for buying opportunity which means um baka sai to go kwa hi e e trend market trend okay so like what i'm going to me are trend lines uh trends unaweza kuona tulikuwa na hi touch we also have this touch we also have this touch now the moment to keep at the other test around this trend line we can even enter more trades okay now let's dive in to the lower time frame uh so that we never to cut a footer entry along this level okay so that we never to cut the other opportunity ya kwenda mpaka maybe around this point or even this point okay now for me nipo kwenye hard time frame ambapo ni kwenye daily now i can see the bigger picture make sure if if you don't know how to uh to properly analyze top down analysis nenda kaangalie Uh, the the last video ambayo nilipost kuhusiana na uh, jinsi ya kufanya top down analysis now kwenye 4 hours you can see right now tulikuwa hapo na hi a uh, strong strong push like this one with this strong strong push and it tukapata a certain correction now this correction tuna expect kwamba tutapata the other impulse around here ili to complete a move now we have we, have, we had this move and this one is the continuation pattern you can see this is a continuation pattern so that tunaweza kupata the the finishing of this leg okay 
I know you guys know, know this kind of tips and now for me hapa nikitaka ni trade e actual pay naweza nikaingia around any area of retracement so that naweza nikakapitalize e empress but all I'm, I'm waiting to for this trade is to take a what uh, a overall position ya ku swing trade ambayo ni for buying opportunity okay now the e retracement ya to you wapi ta share like by studying only price movement and the reaction around this trend line tunaweza tukapata eh, our price action ambayo itakuwa formed around the L20 trade okay so ngoja nitoe hizi placement now let me pray it out so that we can see kwenye one hour yeah so we are into this one hour now i will just wait to take the actual uh, actual position for buying but i can see the only point about tunaweza tukangalia pia ambayo ina line na tl ni around here so i can see it's around here guys around here so let's see vile ambavyo ita pray out and yeah here hapa ni kama stop to correction now let's see how we it it pray out there we go yeah now break out now for the continuation which is the actually impulse now we have this fall okay now i, I will nataka nisubiri like vile price italiact around the here kwa sababu ndo kama uh, price movement ambo e, kama ilikuwa ipo na retrace now pia nitakuwa ipo na confluence ya hii trend line na and the other price action kama mambo ya demand and supply but uh, if you want to dive in about the demand and supply market imbalance order blocks you can check out about the original cause or exclusive highlight cause about uh, such a price movement i know siwezi kuzielezea direct kwenye youtube kwa sababu video itaiza kuwa all way uh, itakuwa ndefu sana okay now tayari tuko na hii price movement around here so let's see vile ambavyo ita react and vile tu tunaweza fanya entry yeah now price movement reacted there Let's see it as reversal candle maybe kwenye hard time frame ni zika 4 hours. So let's see. Yeah, now tali kwenye 4 hours tumepata uh, tumepata hii price action ambayo ni kama kind dodge lakini ni rejection. Now let's see vile price ambayo it reacts and remember the moment ni revo elezea la, la, last last video like you don't exactly enter when the price reacts kwenye support or resistance you have to look at the how price reacts uh, the moment kwa mfano kama hii tani shapata reversal candle i need to see the push away kwa mfano hii ndo impasse i just wait for the actual correction around here so that naweza nikaingia the trade okay i hope tali ushani pata and around the price movement ambayo imekuwa formed this one here nita ingia nao niko na exactly conference ya kuingia hii trade mpaka maybe all way up and stop loss make sure in a bit you are below below this maybe your trend line or such stuff now let me see kwenye one hour yeah now kwenye one hour unaweza kuangalia uzuri like vile ambavyo unaweza ka unaweza minimize your stop loss and all that okay now nitaona share hivi lakini tali ni kwa nishaona ni strong level all the way from the e line about tumeona and the price action about tali shall kwa form the kwenye 4 hours time frame now i want to capitalize the, the wall move okay now the wall move let's get what ratio let's see uh let's king only 21 pips for uh one 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 twenty five pips is not bad now let's see how price reacts now i'm waiting for upper nasa nika set pending order for this trade not to leave me okay and while waiting for such movement nasa pia nika to me uh let's see for trading view now let's see here we go now price reacted and pia may form uh this candle around here kwa nye price movement now for me tali e entry ipo activated na kwa sababu nipo kwenye e level niko confident kui hold the trading paka my take profit okay
mpaka mahitaji profit na resi vile price ita react ah uh, okay na resi now here we go here we go tali to shut up we high now for me to manage this trade inabidi niwe na jua exactly tali hapa nisha achieve my uh, one ratio one uh, mbo ni kama risk reward ratio kwa sababu tali to shut up we high so i expect this guy to get a breakout and the price to continue now let's see tayari breakout sha sha happen and kwa sababu tayari ni sha achieve my risk reward ratio let me see risk reward ratio is 1 ratio 3 17 now kwa sababu tayari ni sha break ni uh, ni sha achieve twice what I've, uh, i have risked now naweza ni ka break even my trade niki break even my trade which means na move my stop loss to entry point so that naweza ni ka dear touch my emotions kwenye hit trade okay na kwa sababu hii ni impulse we can see maybe kwa kutumia fib uh, retracement video ambapo itakuwa na resi na hii retracement market inaweza katani around ya kwa sababu tusha break this level itatani italiact tena ili endelee up na let's see vile ambavyo itakuwa here we go now reacted yeah exactly now you can see price has even reacted kwenye hii market imbalance remember this market imbalance uh, i don't know if you guys understand about market imbalance but you need to also identify understand how is market imbalances in avocado okay but for this it may react around uh is 61% ambayo ilikuwa ni kama market imbalance tali to share recovery at this level now i will see price moving all time high and hitting my target profit now let's see retracement retracement now here hapa ni continuation you can see and you need to understand to actual uh understand how price ambavyo inakuwa na tengeneza hizo moves okay so this is the actual continuation pattern ambo hii ni ompas this collection for for retracement up okay this was my first take profit boy the others take profit naweza nikaweka juu ili nika nika risk free this trade okay and so let's see now correction correction continuation now the actual breakout and the almost hit our take profit guys now for me kwa sababu nisha hit my take profits ambayo ilikuwa ni around 525 and naweza nika risk free au pia naweza nika close partial profits now for this swing trade unaweza kaona like kwenye one day imetumia siku ngapi like i said when you swing trade which means you are using a couple of days holding while holding such a trade okay for this trade ni me hold ilikuwa ni for holding how many days this is the first day second day this is the third day almost two days you guys okay almost two days like in some of the swing trades naweza nikatumia mpaka wiki mbili wiki tatu it also depends kwenye trend ambayo nakuwa nataka ni capitalize so this is how vile ambavyo naweza uh, ku swing trade guys is is not even hard kwa sababu you need to actually understand how price movement reacts how price action reacts how vile price action ambavyo inakuwa inakuambia okay these are some of my trades ambazo nimechukua and one of them ilikuwa ni an uh, NZD UST but the other trade was UST JPY uh, what the actual swing trade the other one was GBPU actual swing trade and the other one ilikuwa ni US 30 ilikuwa ni a nice swing trade you guys nice swing trade the other one ilikuwa ni Audi UST and this Audi UST was very nice kwa sababu pia nilitolea uh, the its analysis kwenye uh, kwenye YouTube the other one was Audi Audi CHF you remember this trade mwambia naendeni mkaangalie go check about this this analysis ambayo nilifanyia what the actual nice trade ambayo nimeza ku capitalize estimated pc 200 estimated 200 ambayo ni risk reward ratio 1 ratio 17 so it's a, was a very nice trend guys now go check out about this analysis ambayo nimezifanya and i'm sure they'll be uh, worth worth they'll be worth of you to you uh for your trading journey guys so this is how i do my analysis and thank you for watching all the way to the end make sure una like and ku subscribe but at the end of the what of uh of this month 
uh, we are going to release our actual course for the airlite now make sure you check it out here ni make a link when you description go uh, leave your email there so that when you launch that the actual course for airlite course online it will be exclusive for all of the airlite community go check it out and then you start enjoying our <laughs> our market analysis and all this kind of stuff so thank you guys i love you and see you next video